All right, so this is part two. Welcome back. Let's dive right in. So first, assuming you spun up a box to deploy on, we can just go ahead and secure copy over the generated tarball, uh, which is right here, along with the setup script to that box. So first, I'm going to copy over the tarball. All right, so now I'll copy over the setup script. And next, let's go ahead and SSH into that box. And so you can see the files here. And now we can go ahead and run that setup script so that we'll untar the tarball and then also set up a new Python environment. And so this will take a few minutes to run. So as soon as Python is done installing, it'll then create and activate a virtual environment and then install the wheel files. So with that done, Let's go ahead and cd into the new application directory. Activate the virtual environment. And let's go ahead and run the tests. And since that passes, now we can just go ahead and fire up G-Unicorn. So I can run this run.sh script. So now G-Unicorn is running on port 1337. And if we go back to the browser, refresh, and see my hello world there. So you could run G-Unicorn as a daemon or even better use a process manager such as supervisor upstart. And so that's all I have. Thanks for watching. Be sure to check the blog post. Thanks again.